This is one of my characters making the journey on horseback to the foot of Weathertop. This lengthy and scenic horseback ride occurs just once in the game as part of the epic quest line. At any other time, you have to make your own way to Weathertop. As in the book The Fellowship of the Ring, the hill can be approached from a number of directions. One way is from this rundown inn in the Lone Lands. The hill can be seen in silhouette here. In the novel, the encounter at Weathertop occurs after six days' journey from Bree. The narrative includes descriptions of terrain, weather, and even some of the early history of Middle-earth. By contrast, the film The Fellowship of the Ring conveys the sense of journey briefly by using a series of short scenes of the Fellowship travelling over varying types of terrain. Their arrival at Weathertop is actually quite abrupt. In the novel there is also a hint a couple of nights before they arrive of Gandalf's presence at Weathertop when Frodo sees some mysterious lights on the horizon at night. The film does away with this altogether. The journey to Weathertop is intercut with sequences showing Gandalf still imprisoned at Isengard. In the novel, the company set up camp in a dell on the western slope of the hill. Features described in the novel, including their fireplace, a stream with a pool, and stacks of firewood are all recreated in the game. The film dispenses with these details. They arrive at Weathertop, which is very much smaller than seen in the game, and even smaller still than described in the novel. Aragorn announces that they will camp here, and the lighting shows that night is indeed fast approaching. Aragorn arms the hobbits, and then goes to look around. Tolkien by contrast, describes half an hour of hard climbing to get to the summit. As seen here, it's not quite as long as that in the game, particularly if you take this short cut. In the film, when the Nazgul attack, the hobbits retreat up a small staircase to the top of the hill, which takes them a matter of seconds. And here we've arrived at the summit. It's noteworthy that in the novel only Merry, Frodo and Aragorn make the journey up here. One of the first things they notice is a stone that was marked by Gandalf and left as a message. There is a quest in the game to locate this. The rune can be seen scratched on the stone, a nice touch. The surrounding grass is also burned, which was another feature described in the book. There are spectacular views in all directions. Looking to the south, as in the book, we can see the road, which was where Frodo and company spotted the Black Riders, which prompted them to beat a hasty retreat back to the Dell. Not much seems to be moving on the road today. We're quite safe. In the film, the fight with the Nazgul takes place here on the summit, not in the Dell. The space on the hilltop is very much smaller, conveying a sense of claustrophobia and entrapment. The jagged broken stones at the top here are actually quite similar. I've mentioned one quest that takes you to the summit of Weathertop, which is to retrieve Gandalf's stone. There is a second quest a little later on, which is an instanced quest called Retake Weathertop, which only takes place at night. And in this quest, the orcs, which are already in the countryside, have taken over the entire hilltop and you have to fight your way to the top. As with many instances, there is a boss fight at the end, uh, in this case a rather large troll. A slightly better outcome than Frodo had.